What's up, everybody? Jason here for jazbeescasebreaks.com. 2023 Topps Chrome Baseball 40 Box Blaster Case Break just sold out. This is a random team break number three, guys. And again, guys, 40 total boxes. Everyone gets a random team in the MLB. Remember, no veteran common ship out of this, unless, of course, it's Otani, Acuna, Freeman, Betts will ship for the MVP buyback chances. Other than that, no veteran base. Everything else does ship, though. And on average, look for two secret parallels and two pink parallels in a box. And obviously, I think in a whole blaster case, I feel like we've hit at least like four, four or five autos. So potentially, obviously, still autograph chances too and, and colors. Here's the dice roll. Here's the customer names. And here's the teams. Let's roll it. We got a six and a four ten times. Good luck. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. 9, 10, 6, 4, 10, 10, Charles down to Steve, Locke, 10 times, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, Giants down the race, All right, so Charles, you have the Giants, Brandon with the Pirates, Stephen Kendrick with the Rangers, David with the Orioles, Jeremy Shortell with the Yankees, Jeremy Port with the Padres, Caitlin with the Cardinals, Anthony with the A's, Steve Locke with the Rockies, Eugene with the uh, Brewers, Jeremy Shortell with the Royals, Jeremy uh, Colton with the Tigers, Billingsley, you have the Diamondbacks, Sam with the Mariners, Charles with the Mets, Scott with the White Sox, Brian with the Blue Jays, Caitlin with the Dodgers, Jeremy Port with the Red Sox, Angel with the Reds, uh, Nguyen with the Braves, Scott Q with the Angels, uh, Angel with the Guardians, Jeremy Shortell with the Nationals, Greg with the Cubs, Sam Clark with the Marlins and Astros, Spencer with the Twins, Brian K with the Phillies, and then Steve with the Rays. Alright, well in the meantime, I'm going to rip open this blaster case right here. I'll lay out the boxes right here too. Unfortunate age, I don't want to be like a bus kill, but I don't think Ellie did a cruise in here for the Reds. You're looking at like Spencer Steer rookies, um, like Ashcraft, Siani. There's like Joey Votto autos in here as well, potentially.
Ellie will be the face of everything next year in 2024. Well, I'm going to close the trade window. I did message Michael. Michael was doing something else right now around the store. He has some other duties. But when he does get a chance, he'll rip the other half. By the way, we still got it done here early, so that's the good thing. All right, so the other half of the case is right there. I have the first half over here. We'll just start ripping. that these packs just rip so easily. They're just basically tearing apart.
Oh, Jake, sorry. <laughs> In my head, I read that, in my head, I read that wrong. I was like, "What did I do to him?" He said he's never gonna break with anybody. Uh, he's never gonna break with me ever, uh, ever again. Sorry. I appreciate that. I mean, hopefully, I did something good for you. It's usually what kind of it is sometimes. I'm very laid back, so it's not like, uh, you know, not a maybe as a energetic as other breakers, but. Usually it's just pulling good stuff for customers, really. Uh, you're good. I, I tend to just like, I, I don't know, I tend to like read it too fast and not really analyze what I read. And then I speak as if like my brain actually read it correctly and then I say the wrong things. I'm like, oh shit, you know? <laughs> Oh, but you're good though, man. I had to reread it again one more time because I was like, man, what did I do to this guy? open probably 10 boxes to start off. Lord is on the board. the love of football. For the love of football. Oh, oh, thank you. No, no worries. I knew you were busy with it. I just hate that these packs rip so easily, dude. They're just like tear apart. It pisses me off. Did you guys book your rooms already? Did you guys end up getting the thing or not? I think we're staying in the middle of the Oh, nice. This is right next to the arena. Oh, well, that's right. Yeah, yeah. Because you're going to be next. Yeah. Just take the. I mean, you guys can obviously walk, but there's that little tram that takes you to. Uh, I think all the way up to Excalibur if it's still open. Really? And then you don't have to walk. Because it'd be like what? New York, New York, Excalibur, uh, Luxor, Zen, Mandalay Bay. Yeah, it is technically in the middle. It's, it's probably the same distance, honestly. But, I mean, at the, at the end of the day, I guess whatever saves you more money. Yeah. And the wave pool. <laughs> That's right. We also have a, I think in, uh, is it matter of the way? No. One of those connecting ones to go to the Luxor or over there is just a fat Tuesday somewhere in those walkways. Do you like the fat Tuesday as well? Yeah. 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 I like those. I like, I used to like walking around with them. <laughs> All right. There we go. Rip these first ten. All right. So again, I'm gonna you know kind of skim through it a little bit. We'll stop for like the sepias and pinks. You know, bigger rookies and stuff like that. But only top ramen now, thanks to the case breaks. <laughs> you know, ramen still tastes pretty good. <laughs> it's not bad. 
I just, it's funny, now going to the grocery store, I, I just noticed so many, like, different variations of ramen now. Like, you know, back in the day, I feel like it was just only the two, right? Like, the the cup of noodle ones are, like, you know, the ramen square ones you just throw, like, in a pot of hot water. Now, like, I seen the other day, there's, like, tapatio ones. There's, like, all the, you know, different, like, Asian brand ones that, like, have all these crazy flavors. And it's kind of crazy to see. It's, like, it's really advanced. Like I bought a tapatio one like two weeks ago and it was like new new ramen or new like I don't know, it was like a different style of ramen or something like that. I have no idea, but it was okay. Nice Francisco Alvarez sepia. Hunter Brown. Ija Lemayu. Yeah, that's that's what I mean, yeah. Incarnacion, Gunnar Henderson, Technicolor, Juan Soto, Sepia. Yeah, I've always been like the shrimp one. I've always liked the shrimp flavor. You don't like shrimp flavor? Oh yeah, you don't like seafood, huh? Get out of here, dude. Get out of here now. <laughs> How do you not like seafood? I liked the chicken when I was a kid, but I'm not a little guy no more. There's an Otani. Whoever has the Angels, I think it's Scott's gonna rack up on Otani's in this. Like, big time. Burns. Tristan Casas being. And, wow, look at that! Peraza, autographed to 199 for the Yankees. And uh, that is Yankees' Jeremy Shortell. There you go. Well, like I said, there is autograph opportunities, and there you go. That's one of them. Oh, yeah, I did see the billboard for that fight you're going to. It was Shevchenko yeah. round two, right, or something like that? Josh Young, Sean Murphy, Gunnar Anderson, P. Marcus Simeon, nice James Alvin, Refractor. We got Carlos Perez. Woods Richardson, Giancarlo Stan, Whoa. Ellen Jones, Mookie, that could be worth 40 bucks right there, Pascantino, Show the sheet one more time. I don't think I showed it after trade window closed. Jared Walsh, Matt Olson, Jamie Villard, Gabriel Moreno, Bella Thompson. Down. Playing the leaders and Kettle Marte number to 199. Yadi, Salvador Perez, and little Wander Franco.
Vladdy Jr. Peter Downs. Go Florida. I thought Joe said he was going to be drafting today. Did he do that already? Yeah, let's see. Adley. And DJ Hall to 275. DL. Or DL Hall, sorry. <laughs> That's a DJ. <laughs> DL, what is he trying to hide? I get it, because down low. So his first name is Down Low Hall? Nice joke, Jason. Uh, Bregman. Christopher Morale Refractor. Gonzalez. Colas. Alright. Alright, I'll rip these next 10 and then we'll have the next 20 behind me ready. Well, at least you get to go to sleep. Uh, go uh, go to late tomorrow, and then you leave early today. Yeah. So, what time do you usually go to sleep? Like last night, if you have to come in early, do you try to go to sleep early? No, I right? Tried to. <laughs> I was in like two last night. Yeah, I went around to it too. And I wake up like at 8, and then go get my car to get service, and then I go get some milk. At 8? Yeah. And I woke up at 8, had to go get my car service, it took like two hours. I went to Costco to get gas. Went to go get some milk. So we didn't have no more milk, and I was making pancakes, so I was like, alright. <laughs> I literally just dragged my ass out of bed to get a shower. <laughs> there you go. Alright, here we go, next 10. So again guys, I think after this that Cosmic was really close, so that'll be breaking soon. And I think for Steam 2 Boxer might be sold out now. Let's see. Yeah, Cosmic is sold out now. Two boxes actually have four left, so. We'll have to do that after the Cosmic. If you guys want to do the co uh, pristine pick your team, that's also down to 11 now. Whoa. Ramon told me yesterday he got tickets to the 49ers Cardinals game. He did? In Arizona. Oh, nice. yeah, that's he, was trying to do that game. he was like, uh, he was telling me, he's like, yeah, but I don't know. I don't know if I'm excited because, you know, what if the Cardinals are tanking? I'm like, so what? And I was like, you'll see your team dominate. <laughs> he's like, no, but I want to see a good game. I was like, oh, I get that, I guess. If you want to see a good game, you probably bought the worst, <laughs> the worst game. <laughs> I was like, well, I don't know if it's December. Kyler, we'll see by then if he's like even active anymore or I don't know. I was like, he's like, no, I really want to see Kyler play. I was like, yeah, no, I get that. I was like, that game I went to, Kyler Murray is dumb. He slid right before the first down. And then he spiked it without knowing that it was already third down. I was like, bro. Yeah, week one though, we played the, the Commanders. That'll, that'll be like a good gauge to like see how bad we're really going to be this season. Yeah. Because the Commanders aren't that good. And yeah. Is he, he's not, he's, he's on the pub list, right? So he's not from yeah. starting the first four. So their starter's gonna be dogs? Yeah. Wait, why? 
Like, why would you trade for him out of all guys? I mean, I guess they really didn't want Cole McCoy no more, I guess. Yeah. I guess maybe they wanted to run a similar offense with Kyler. Like a running quarterback, I guess, but I don't know. They could have tried to trade Lance, but I'm sure Niners would have sent them to Arizona. Yeah, they weren't going to send them to Arizona, probably. Plus, the Cowboys gave up like a third or fourth pick, whatever it was. So knocked out cold. Oh my god. They need to check on that dude. <laughs> you got hit hard. How much a helmet too? Bam right there the second one. Let's see if it did get his helmet. That looked like it did. Did you really, Eric? That's actually very smart. That's like, uh, what is it called? Uh, yeah, like the shake and bake <laughs> of Taki version. Uh, this is actually a pretty big game, actually. Utah is playing right now on Thursday Night College Football Week. Utah is playing at home against Florida. Yeah, football, college football is officially back this Saturday for mainly everybody now. I'd rather have Utah lose, you know, but. Football's fun, man. Oh man, you missed it. What a dude. I think college football could be just a little bit more exciting, and more passionate than the NFL, because obviously, you know, they're trying to make a name for themselves, and you know, now they some players do get paid right with the NILs, but obviously, you're trying to get seen to beat to make the big bucks on the next level. So it's always fun. Are they gonna fit? They should be fair. Yeah, I mean, I, I like spicy, so I, I mean, I love hot Cheetos, Takis, all that stuff. I don't eat it as often, but when I was younger, you know, get some hot Cheetos, a little bit of lemon, squeeze all over it. Sometimes if you wanted it more spicy, throw some tapatio on that too. <laughs> But I've actually never tried it like that with chicken, though. <laughs> it's just it's so stupid as things. I 
I know, you had breakfast already, Duncan? I was about to say, it's like breakfast time for you, huh? Damn, this pack is huge. It's like two packs in one. Did he say that? No, I don't know if I heard that. He just got chosen to be captain today. Really? I don't know. I don't know about that. No, you don't like to eat breakfast either, huh? Breakfast is like the best meal of the day. Man, these are wild. Well, that's what I'm saying, like that. Okay, well, yeah. <laughs> and everybody's outside of the house by the time I wake up. That's true. I mean, I grew up obviously like in a Mexican household, so obviously like, you know, a lot of good food. But yeah, some French toast. She hits the spot. So 30 more boxes to go. I have 10 here ripped and then Michael's basically done there. I do not, but I've been hearing a lot of customers do buy and sell there. Discord. Wow, look at that blue. Esteban for the Cubs. To 150. That is Greg. His name was McClanahan. I thought it was uh, McCallahan. But yeah, then I saw you saying it, I was like, it's a clan? I was like, oh yeah, it is. Thank you, good sir. Alright, there you go guys. So now, now we don't have to worry about ripping another 20 boxes. Thanks to little Mikey. Mike Trout. Tendi. 
And a green Christopher Morell. Out of 99. Nice Nolan Gorman CPF. Ziko Tovar, there's a show Otani. And nice Tyler Freeman auto. For the Guardians. Guardians, that is Angel. J.D. Martinez, nice purple letter to 250 for the Dodgers. And a Kaylin. Freddie Freeman, CPF. Tony Refractor, that's 40 bucks back right there. Scott with that one. Nice, another $20 there. Bo Naylor autograph. Nice, another autograph for the Guardians, and that's Angel. And a Pete Alonzo to 99. A little Pulsar green for the Mets going to Charles. Nice blaster box right there. Well, Duncan, when he wins MVP, he'll be part of the buyback program. And uh, when you go to your local car shop participating, $20 a base, $40 a refractor. Certain colors could be over $100. And I don't think there's no max. You can bring as many as you want. So yeah, it's like about $20 base. So basically someone that has the angels in this break, 20 bucks potentially, 40 bucks there, another $20 there. So far halfway through this case. Uh, there's another $20 there. So yeah, Angel Squad is just raking right now. Just with the Otanis. Okay, so I have 20 boxes right here, like legit. All right there on that cart. So I'm gonna bring them over here. Probably do 10 at a time. And we'll bring the next 10. Cool, Joe, awesome. I, I have to go through orders. I mean, this was gonna take me about 45 minutes to an hour. So, but I believe the Cosmic sold out first. So we're probably gonna have to do the Cosmic before we do the two boxers, so. 
Nightbot drops that link right there that gives you the access to our break schedule. Once I go through the orders and figure out a time frame of when that'll break, it'll be on there. And then uh, we'll break it at some point later. Probably in the next hour, I assume. one has the four spots but we also have a filler so obviously we have to also do the filler all right so that's 10 right there let me have another 10 over there Jay Lang Lears to one ninety nine. Gary Mitchell. That could potentially be 40 bucks. Obviously, the NL is still a little wide open in the sense that it could be Acuna, it could be Mookie, it could be even Freddie Freeman, potentially. I think you can even throw Matt Olsen in there if something were to happen to the top three. But it's not a for sure thing yet. Jacob DeGrom. Riley Green Pink. Johnny, what's going on, man? Gunnar Henderson. This year, and then we'll go with the last ten. And nice, Anthony Rendon to one uh, three ninety nine. Nice, that's sick, dude. One blaster box magic.
Topanga. Sanga. Later, Jay. See you later. See you tomorrow. Alright, I'll see you manana. Alright, sweet. Ten more boxes, guys, but they're already ripped, so we're just gonna go through the cards. So, so far we've got in four autos. Let's see if we can get one more, or maybe two. Jesus, man, who the fuck is calling, dude? It's just these random numbers. Well, there you go. There's another autograph. Ryan Aguilar to 299 for the Angels. Buena Scott. Purple. Speckle. Corbin Carroll pink, there you go. Didn't do that one. Herrera. Tatis. Jordan Walker pink. Whoa, look at that. Soto. Ultraviolet. All stars. And that is going to go to the Padres. Jeremy Port. Nice. Zico Tovar. Jose Altuve at 150, a little color match there. Astros, Sam Clark. Alright, three more boxes, guys.
Taylor Ward to 299 for the Angels. Scott with that one. All right, last box, fellas. Here we go. Good luck, everybody. Christopher Morrell, Sepia, and a Jazz Chisel. Nice. To 350. Marlon's going to Sam. Senga Pink. And Freeman Sepia. All right. So we did get quite a few numbered cards. So obviously, we got one numbered, or sorry, one numbered card, two, three. All right, it's one Otani there, four. Five. Look at all the Otanis here. Six, seven. Eight, nine, ten, eleven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Well, about eleven numbered cards. So obviously, that's a little added bonus there for these blasters. Obviously, Otani-wise, one, two, three, four, and a refractor. So definitely over $100 of value there. And then autograph wise, we'll do a quick recap. We did get Ultraviolet's case hit, Juan Soto, Taylor, or sorry, Ryan Aguilar for the Angels. And then we got Bo Naylor and Freeman Guardians autograph, Blue, Estevan for the Cubs, and then Oswald Peraza, 499. So there you go, guys. Thank you guys so much. That's Chrome Blaster number three, jazbeescasebreaks.com, guys. Thank you.